Hi, my Leos. It's Jamie Zebra 23. Um, I'm doing your weekly spread for the week of April 30th, 2018 for my Leo Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. Um, um, if you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 72 hours. I also have a new feature, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. Um, I've got a terrible cold. That's why I sound like this and look like this. My nose is bright red like Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Yeah. Okay. I've also added a ton of new stuff to the website, including, including these amethyst um, pendants. I've got rose quartz, and I've got um, lapis lazuli. So the rose is pink, and the um, and the lapis is blue. Okay, so we've got four cards here. This is for the week of April 30th, 2018, for my Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. You've got the Page of Cups, you've got the Five of Cups, you've got the Tower card, and you've got the Fool. Okay, so business calls, lots and lots of business calls for Leo. Leo. Okay, um, keep in mind these are general readings. They might resonate, they might not resonate. Um, I can't give you guys like a bubblegum weirdo reading just to make you guys clap and say woohoo. Sorry, it's a real channel. If you want flowers and sausages, go to another channel. Okay, so lots and lots of calls about business. I feel like for some of you, this, these business calls are incredible. Opportunities coming, but for some of you, it's people backing out. For those of you that are trying to sell an app or get an app going, or for those of you that are trying to um, do business of some sort, some of you trying to get a loan for something, trying to trying to rob Peter to pay Paul to kind of get things to go your way, it's looking like some of some of the things will work and some of them will fall through. The big ones are going to fall through, is what this is showing. Um, but I feel like some of you are not ready for what you're looking for. Some of you are so used to in the past everything just going your way and you're not having to put much effort behind it. Um, keep in mind these are general, like I said. So if it does not apply, it does not apply. Okay? All right. All right. <laughs> Pay for my husband. <laughs> All right. So yeah. So for some of you, this will apply. Some of you, it won't. So business dealings, some of them falling through, some of them working out. Listen, I just heard liar, liar, pants on fire. Watch what you're saying. Make sure what you're saying is accurate to certain people. You know, if it's if it's something like if you lie on this application, you could be legally liable. Pay attention to that fine print because it looks like some of you will be legally liable. Also, some of you are showing your face too much in a place where you should not. Are you... It's kind of like... Where there's smoke, there's fire. I'm seeing some of you keep... <coughs> Excuse me, I'm sick. Some of you keep showing up where you don't belong. So it's kind of like... It's almost like a legal activity. It's kind of like... How come every time somebody needs to cash a check, this person shows up? How come this person's got all these checks with, with different names? So some of you could be forging. Or how come somebody's going to pick up uh, prescriptions or something? The same person's picking up 35 people's prescriptions. Some of you need to back up and step out because whatever is going on here, somebody's, the jig is up. So step back. Leo, if this is you doing this, knock it off. If, um, if this is somebody around you, it could be your child, son, daughter, uh, mother, father. If they're doing this behavior, make them stop because they're going to get in trouble. Okay, not only that, but it looks like there's a busybody. So if some of you live in like a small community or it's the same people at the store every time for years, there's a busybody that's going to be making a phone call. So watch it. Um, all right, now let's move on to something else. Let's move on to love and romance. Oh, yes. Okay, so some of you, um, you're going to find out some not, some not so good news about love and romance. Somebody could be cheating on you, having an affair, buying hookers. Uh, it doesn't look like, you know, I, I want to pull back the affair. I don't see an affair. I see like a one night stand. Like we know what it is. Like it's an exchange of money for sex, that kind of thing. Or like gifts for sex or this person sleeping with me because I'm powerful. It's that kind of an energy here. So, so, so for those of you that are coupled up or married, you could be finding out this information. Somebody doesn't answer the phone. Somebody doesn't really tell you the truth about where they're at or you find out little white lies 
and then you find out that this person is actually sleeping around or cheating. This could be this could be somebody doing this to you, or you could be doing some this to somebody. Especially if it's a if it's a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy, or person, or a um with a fire sign. So Sagittarius, Leo, Aries, or a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio attached to a Leo. Um, it shows that kind of energy. Um, and this person could be the third party. That element could be the third party. I'm also seeing that for some of you, you need to watch your temper. If you do find out some bad information this week, watch your temper. Now, some of you have a Cancer, a Pisces, or a Scorpio from the past that's going to be contacting you. They want you back. Things didn't work out very well. Things didn't go the way that you thought that they should. But this person does want to make amends with you. They're not perfect. They can never be perfect. For some of you, you feel like whatever this person did was too much and they can never redeem themselves for what they've done. And then for others of you, it's a water sign that feels like you could never redeem yourself or or you could never make up for, for the nasty things that you've done. Um, it's going to be, I feel like this week and also through the month of May 2018, it's going to be a situation of if I can't get past what you've done and we can't heal, then we don't need to be together. It looks like somebody could be making serious plans to really get out of a situation, to get out of a marriage, to get out of a boyfriend girlfriend situation, to get out of a living arrangement. Somebody's going to be going all out to try to to try to end something without being harmed, without losing. Somebody's concerned about losing children. Somebody's concerned about losing money. Somebody's concerned about losing everything. Basically, like if I'm not with this person, well, I won't have a car to drive. How will I get my kids from A to B? How will I do this? So somebody's very very much in the mix of. I need to get, how, how do I get out? When can I get out? Where can I go? Who can help me? Can I, do I get an advocate? What do I do? Um, but also somebody's collecting information to try to get somebody in trouble so that they'll be able to run away quick, that kind of thing. Would Because they figure if the other party's in jail, then I can get away quick. If this person goes down legally, then I've got some sort of a, a leg to stand on moving forward. So somebody's definitely going to be involved in some of that. All right, guys, um, that was your weekly spread. Ta-ta for now, my Leos.